After years of trying to find a buyer, the king of country, George Strait, finally sold his mega mansion in San Antonio, Texas in 2022. Set on a 12.2 acre hill, this estate boasts just under 8,000 square feet of space with features like 14 fireplaces, panoramic views, a stunning swimming pool, as well as unique design elements like stained glass, imported adobe walls, and much more. With a stellar country music career, Strait holds records for number one albums, singles, and a consecutive 30-year streak in the top 10. Inducted into the Country Music Hall of Fame in 2006, Strait's influence extends beyond Nashville. Strait is said to own several properties in the Lone Star State. While he's known to spend a ton of time at a ranch close to Cotulla, the family ranch where he was raised is in Pearsall, Texas, and this one has been in his family for over a hundred years. George Strait, often called the king of country, was born in 1952 in Poteet, Texas, growing up in a cattle ranching family. His early life on the ranch laid the foundation for his deep connection to Texas, a sentiment that would later influence both his musical and personal choices. George's love story began when he met his future wife, Norma Voss, in high school. The two quickly developed a connection that would end up withstanding the test of time. In 1971, George and Norma exchanged vows and embarked on a journey that has spanned decades. The couple faced early challenges, with George serving in the U.S. Army during the Vietnam War. Despite the distance and uncertainties, their love endured. After his military service, George pursued his passion for music, and with Norma by his side, he navigated the competitive landscape of the music industry. In the early 1980s, George and Norma faced a tragedy that would test the strength of their bond. The couple tragically lost their 13-year-old daughter daughter Jennifer in a car accident. The heartbreak was immeasurable and George later channeled his grief into the emotional ballad Baby Blue as a tribute to his beloved daughter. Despite the hardships, George and Norma Strait remained committed to each other. Norma became George's rock, providing steadfast support as he achieved unprecedented success in country music. George Strait's career soared with hits like Amarillo by Morning, The Chair, and All My Exes Live in Texas, solidifying his status as a country music icon. Throughout their enduring love story, George and Norma welcomed their son, George Bubba Strait Jr., who has since become a successful businessman. The Straits also became grandparents. In 2022, George Strait sold his longtime and unique mansion in San Antonio, Texas. It was reported that after sitting on the market for a few years, Strait had finally sold the home to Shannon Rawson, who owns a medical staffing company in San Antonio called Angel Staffing Inc. Strait originally listed the estate for $10 million in 2018 and before a few price cuts. Perched on a 12.2 acre hilltop, George's mansion was custom crafted by sculptor turned architect Bill Tall into a distinctive adobe residence and it underwent a meticulous two year year construction process. A dominant force in country music, Strait boasts an unparalleled array of awards. He holds records for the most number one albums, singles, gold albums, platinum albums, and multi-platinum albums in the history of the genre. No wonder he's called the king of country. George Strait stands as the sole artist with the highest of number one songs and top five songs in music history. Now, his remarkable success was achieved outside the confines of Nashville as he declined an invitation to join the Grand Ole Opry, opting to stay in Texas and create music that resonated with people. George and his wife Norma bought this property in San Antonio's upscale Dominion Country Club neighborhood during the mid-1990s. The 7,925 square foot mansion showcases panoramic views and features 14 hand sculpted fireplaces, four bedrooms, and seven baths throughout. The main residence actually holds three bedrooms and six baths, complemented by a fully self-contained casita on the ultra-private property with one bed, one bath, a living room, kitchenette, and fireplace. 
Each bedroom in the main house boasts an ensuite bathroom and a fireplace with the master suite offering separate his and hers bathrooms and closets along with two fireplaces. As you might expect from a home this sprawling, there's also a chef's kitchen in the main house with top of the line stainless appliances, a massive island, and a designer fridge. There's a handful of spots for dining and entertaining both inside and on the outdoor terraces. Unique design elements include stained glass windows, artist murals, cactus rib shutters, and walls constructed from imported adobe. Other highlights at the straight mansion include a fully equipped gym with a separate bath and sauna, as well as a walk-in safe room. The residence captures breathtaking views of San Antonio and the Texas Hill Country Club from its infinity-edged glass tile pool and spa, creating a picturesque setting for sunset and evening lights. Out back, there's also a patio with built-in grill, sink, ice maker, and fridge, while elsewhere, you'll find a sports court. This home has undergone extensive updates since 2020, including a new roof and windows. George grew up in the small town of Purcell, Texas, surrounded by the expansive family ranch where his parents, John Byron Strait and Doris Kozer Strait, worked as cattle ranchers. The Strait family's connection to the land instilled in George a profound love for Texas and its cowboy culture, which would later become a hallmark of his iconic country music career. The family's ranch was located near Big Wells and gave George some unique experiences from tending to cattle to learning the ins and outs of ranch life. As George Strait's musical talents began to emerge, he found inspiration in the stories and rhythms of his rural surroundings. The honky tonks and dance halls, that dotted the Texas landscape fueled George's passion for country music. It's said that the king of country owned several Lone Star State homes, including a different ranch close to Cotilla and this same family ranch where he was raised in Pearsall, which has been in the Strait family for over a hundred years. The ranch operates as a fully functional cattle ranch, housing not only cattle, but horses, donkeys, chickens, and pigs. Beyond its role as a working ranch, George's Texas estate harbors various businesses. A country store on the premises offers local goods, accompanied by a restaurant and bar. The restaurant is accessible to the public and specializes in Texas-style barbecue, while the bar caters to ranch guests with live music on weekends. George Strait's 6,000-acre ranch is about 30 miles west of San Antonio in a serene and secluded location in Medina County. The extensive grounds include a main house, guest house, lake, swimming pool, tennis courts, outdoor kitchen, 12-stall barn, and an outdoor arena. Known as the King George, George's ranch has a rich history, dating back to its original purchase by George's great-grandfather, George Washington Strait, in 1883. Initially used as a cattle and horse ranch in the early 1900s, George's father, John Strait, assumed control in the late 1940s, focusing on breeding and training quarter horses. George Strait Sr. continued the ranch's legacy as a horse ranch until 2009, when George Strait Jr. acquired the property, renaming it the King George. Comprising the main house, guest house, and bunk house, the land serves as a residence for Strait's family and ranch hands. The property features several stocked ponds and isn't only a working ranch, but home to diverse businesses. The property houses an array of animals, showcasing the charm of Texas's expansive ranches. In 2014, George and his wife Norma opened their ranch to the public, offering tours, close encounters with animals, and overnight stays in cabins. As George approaches retirement from touring, the future of his Texas ranch remains uncertain. Whatever happens, the ranch will undoubtedly remain a pivotal part of George Strait's legacy. While that wraps up our George Strait house tour, we were able to see how close the king of country continues to align himself with his roots in Texas. Before we go, answer this question for me. What would be your favorite part of owning a ranch? Mine would be the animals, but let me know yours down in the comments. Don't forget to hit subscribe and turn on your notifications so you never miss a video. I'm Kara the Vampire Slayer, follow me on Instagram to chat, and I'll see you all next time. Bye! Hey everyone, it's Kara, or Kara the Vampire Slayer as you might know me, and given my love for all things house and home, I recently wanted to get more hands on myself, and I started tackling DIY projects at my own house. 
Being a new homeowner, there are plenty of unexpected things to fix, and it's cool to learn what you're doing and hopefully be able to fix it yourself. There are also plenty of DIY projects suitable for beginners like me to do, and ones that improve the look of your space drastically. Follow me and I'll teach you what I'm learning and motivate you to join me. You can DIY on a budget even if you're a total beginner. Follow me on Fix It with Kara and we can chat.